What's up, Eagles fans? Welcome inside the film room presented by Lincoln Financial Group. I'm Fran Duffy, and today we're going to take a look here at the Eagles rookie running back, Kenny Gainwell, a player that opted out this past year in 2020. But when you go back to 2019, his only year playing at the college level, you can see why I was really excited about him a year ago last summer after studying him on film because he is a dynamic presence at the running back spot because of his versatility. And again, this guy has only played one year of college football. Not only that, but it was his only time playing running back because he was a quarterback at high school down in Yazoo City uh, in Mississippi. This is a guy who is new to the position but was extremely productive in his lone year as a starter. So let's take a look here at Gainwell. Redshirt freshman, number 19 here on this play, playing up against South Alabama. And this is going to be a counter run play where he is going to just see the C's part and you just see the vision and the feel. Now, obviously a huge hole, but watch as he gets to the second level, a lot of guys, they're, they're looking at, where's the defender? How can I go and try and make him miss? I'm going to try and run to the defender. He is always looking for grass. So he's going to make that guy miss. Now he takes off. He cuts back again, makes another defender miss, plays off another, back from, another block from a receiver. You see the, the nice job he does creating a huge play in the running game. Let's take a look at another play here where this time he gets flexed out. And this was a big part of his game is his ability as a pass catcher. And, and we're going to see here, this wasn't just screens and check downs. He caught over 50 passes as a freshman for the Tigers, and he was used in a lot of different ways. Here's Gainwell, again, flexed out. So he moves down as the X receiver. He is the lone receiver on a three by one set. He's lined up outside the numbers, and now he's got to go win. And so he wins here on a fade route, and he catches a back shoulder fade from the quarterback, takes off, makes the first man miss, makes the second man miss. Huge, huge play down the left sideline. And again, this is a guy catching a back shoulder fade as a running back. And we're going to see a lot of other different ways that he was used. He is, it's a very unique skill set. What a great catch here by Kenny Gainwell on the boundary. Makes a huge, huge play in the pass game for the Memphis Tigers. Let's take a look at another play here. Again, where you get a sense of his playmaking ability. And again, it's going to be another counter run play. So you get offensive guard pulling. You're going to get the backside off tight end. He's going to be pulling as well to the play side. Gainwell's going to play off these blocks. This one's not as clean, not as huge a hole as that first play we did, right? But you're going to see his ability to pick his way through the briar patch. He trusts the blocks that are developing. Here's the guard. He's going to seal off here. You're going to get the tackle creating a block. Here comes the tight end around. He's going to block the force player. Kenny Gainwell's just going to trust these blocks are going to hit. And he just puts his foot in the ground and goes. And he runs away from the defense here. You love the trust. You love the ability to cut back. And he's always looking for green grass. Takes this for a touchdown, a 50-yard run uh, for pay dirt. Just an awesome job there by Kenny Gainwell uh, in the run game. And I, when you look again, just that versatile skill set for a guy that did not play a ton, of a ton of football at the college level, he's used in a lot of different ways. And here, lined up in the backfield, he's just going to run a little Texas route. This was the favorite route of Darren Sproles. How, many, how often did we see Darren Sproles run this route, not just in Philadelphia, but in New Orleans and with the Chargers in San Diego as well? He's going to slow play it. He's going to sell the, all right, I'm just going to kind of run out to the flat. Slow plays this route, doesn't go too fast into the break. Then you see him accelerate, break the tackle with a violent stiff arm, makes the safety miss. He's got his eyes up, looking for who's the next guy I have to make miss. I'm picking up as much ground as possible. Kenny Gainwell, awesome in the passing game. And he'll chip in in pass protection as well, which is a lot of fun uh, to be able to watch over the course of his career. He can do a lot of different things in the passing game. Let's take a look at another play here uh, in the passing game where this time he's lined up just straight in the slot. You've got another back in the backfield here. Uh, so, again, you can kind of speak to this versatile skill set. He can be used in a lot of different ways package-wise. So you've got another running back here. Here's Gainwell, and he's going to be lined up where he's going to just basically just run a vertical route. He's going to run a corner route from the slot, and look at a catch down the field. Again, a ver he's running routes like a wide receiver, making catches like a wide receiver, not just simple screens and passes to the flat and check downs. Just an outstanding job over the shoulder through contact coming up with this football down the field. Let's take a look at another Kenny Gainwell play. Again, as a pass catcher, watch him this time. He gets flexed out from the backfield. He's a once again lined up as an X receiver. All right, so here he is on the, as a lone receiver to the boundary. You've got three receivers to the opposite side, and he's going to work vertically. And watch the catch as he's able to make downfield. Sells the vertical route, back shoulder, makes the defender miss, walks into the end zone. 
that's a, when you have that kind of matchup player, defenses really struggle with how they're going to try and, and figure out how to defend you. And a linebacker can get a little bit lost in space. And now if they got to send you a corner your way, well, now they have to figure out how they're going to defend all the other players on the field. It's a, a really tough problem defenses have to face. He makes it really difficult. He's not the, the blazing 4-3, 40-yard dash kind of matchup guy. He, just with his skill set, everything that he's asked to do in that offense, he makes it a really, really difficult cover. Once again, here we go. Motion out of the backfield. This time, once again, as the X receiver, only receiver to that side of the field. We're out to zero on this time. Linebacker's a little bit stressed. You can already see this linebacker's not really happy about having to make this, uh, having to make this play. He's just running a simple fade, catches his back shoulder, tough catch, comes up with it along the boundary for a first down. This time against Penn State. You know, Memphis, they played in the AAC. You know, maybe you're worried about, oh, the, the level of competition wasn't great. They didn't play a big-time program. This is the Cotton Bowl uh, that year. They played against Penn State. Memphis had a great season that year. They won the American Athletic Conference against Penn State. Out of the pistol, just watch this run play. Makes that first man miss. Gets to the sideline, runs through contact from the safety. There's an next play in the run game. So we'll just take a look at it from the end zone angle. Again, against Penn State. Constantly just trusting his blocks, making defenders miss. Again, uh, just really, really impressive. This was a game I was actually at. Uh, this was the Temple game at Lincoln Financial Field. So this is not the first time uh, that, that uh, Kenny Gainwell will take snaps inside the link. You're going to see him here on this little power run play. You're going to get a guard pulling from the backside. Here comes Gainwell following his block. Just watch the job he does. He sees that this linebacker is going to scrape over the top. See what? Watch where his eyes are. He sees the linebacker scraping over. He's just going to pick his way through. He sees that hole created. Nice job by here by the center. He puts his foot in the ground and goes. Makes another man miss here at the second level. He had a touchdown run in this game where he's making defenders miss. Uh, really fun player to be able to study. And again, it's not because he's you know the 4-3 speed guy. When you look at his versatile skill set, route running, the ability to be moved all around the formation, the ball skills for the running back position, but also his improved vision, just the guy that has not played a ton of running back, but he was really, really productive as a redshirt freshman. I loved watching this guy play. Really, really fun to see in person. I can't wait to see him here in person in Eagles green here uh, the rest of this offseason and through into the fall. Kenny Gainwell, a lot of fun to break down. Thanks so much for joining us here for this film breakdown here inside the film room presented by Lincoln Financial Group. I'm Fran Duffy. We will talk to you soon. We're going to keep breaking down all these rookies right here in the film room.